The last item on the agenda for tonight is REC 2014-3. Staff, you please present this case. Yes, sir. Um, some of your property here is located on the corner of Madison Highway and Jumping Gully. This is down south, uh, in southwest Lowndes County in Clydeville. And what the applicants are proposing is to change the zoning from an R10 residential, which is currently vacant, uh, to a CG commercial. Um, that CG commercial is something that is not consistent with the future development map, but staff thought it was just a better fit for the area with proposed residences potentially in the future. So we did recommend uh, for that, we found it inconsistent with the map, but consistent with the goals and policy. Carried it forward with a recommendation of approval. Don't have any updates to report uh, since last week, but we do believe it's ready for your consideration. All right. Are there any questions? Are there any questions for the staff from the commission? There being none, is there anyone in the audience that would like to speak in favor of this request? Good evening, Commissioners. Bill Nigel, 1007 North Patterson Street. I am uh, here on behalf of the applicants. Um, as y'all know, I also represent Terramore Development. Um, they have the property under contract right now with uh, the applicants, Aubrey and Thanks for <coughs> um, And the purpose of the rezoning request is to develop and construct a dollar general store on that property. Um, the applicants, uh, from what I understand, I believe the Stricklands live across the street, across Jumping Yellow from this property, and I think that's the only residential property in the area. Um, it is right down from the school, and there are some other CG zoning properties, I believe further to the, to the southwest, um, to keep going down Madison Highway. So, um, here to answer any questions you may have, I do have a, a rough site plan if anybody would like to see that, and unfortunately I just have one copy, I'm happy to pass it around to you, but um, the developer at this point is really not to the stage of having a final site plan. So, uh, also, I'm sorry, the engineer Clayton Milligan is here from Global Engineering and Tom Lodges from Terminal. If y'all have questions for them. Absolutely. If you go on so far as to have some idea of what kind of dollar store is it going to be? Is it going to be the little tin building? Is it going to be brick? Is it going to be like you did in Hay High or like? You know, there's a, and I don't know if we're there yet, but it would be Dollar General's prototypical store for this building size. And from what I've seen, you know, there is Dollar General on, on the interchange of I-75 and Madison Highway right there that has masonry uh, mm -hmm. facade. So I believe it would be something similar to that. I'm just curious. Yeah, but I'm, I, and Tom, you want to come up here and address that? I don't know if the developer's there yet to tell you exactly what that plan would look like. My name's Tom Hodges, uh, one of Fort Celeste Court, Thompson, Georgia. And we really haven't, uh, Bill pretty much touched on it. Uh, we haven't put this in front of our architects yet. Um, this project is still in the very preliminary stages. Um, Dollar General has looked at it and, and approved project as a whole, uh, but we have not got to the stage of design to show them this stage. So maybe help you with the size of it. It looks like on a preliminary site plan, we're looking at a building of about 9,000 square feet. Any All right. Just curious. Sure. In, in, may I? Go ahead. In comparison to like your Dollar General, like on uh, 94 or 133 in Truebill and the one on Old Ballester Road, how, how will it relate to those? Smaller or larger? In terms of building size, yeah. um, this is the 9100. So this would be like the one on Bay Tree. Uh, hey, Hyrule, oh, yeah. Okay. Hey, Hyrule was the larger store, so the smaller mm -hmm. store. Um, that's a 12,480 worth of store. Um, so Dollar General basically has three prototypes. You have the 9100. Uh, uh, 12,000 roughly, and then there's a market, but you won't see any of those. So it's the one like it's going to be at, um, what is it, uh, Jerry Jones and Bay Tree? That's right. Um, cool. On the yeah. Okay. All right. Are there any other questions for the uh, speakers? Thank you very much. Thank you. Is there anyone else in the audience that would like to speak in favor of this request? 
There being none, is there anyone in the audience who would like to speak in opposition to this request? There being none, the discussion is now open amongst the commissioners. There's no discussion. I will now entertain a motion from the commissioners. Mr. Chair. Mr. Wills. Um, I make a motion that we recommend approval uh, from R10 to CG to the commissioners with no standing um, conditions. All right. So we have a motion and a second on this agenda item. Is there any discussion on the motion? There being none, all those in favor of this motion, please indicate by raising your right hand. The motion passes unanimously.